Have you ever heard people say, well, God told me, or the Holy Spirit revealed to me? Well, handled the right way. That is biblical. So we're going to talk about what the right way is in our verse of the day today. It's John chapter 16, verses 12 and 13. We're going to talk, I'm going to read it to you. We're going to talk about it in a minute, and then I have a question for you at the end. So starting in verse 12, this is Jesus talking about he, the Holy Spirit. I still have many things to say to you, but you cannot bear them now. However, when he, the Spirit of truth, has come, he will guide you into the truth for he will not speak on his own authority, but whatever he hears, he will speak, and he will tell you things to come. So, my friends, the role of the Holy Spirit is twofold. First of all, his first job is to call you to the saving grace of Jesus Christ. We don't just wake up one day and decide we're going to follow Christ. The Holy Spirit put that desire into your heart, and you either said yes or no. So for those of us who said yes, then he, as in verse 13 tells us, he guides us and he will tell us and help us understand the path that the Father wants us to go through in life. So my friends, we have to be careful when people tell us, oh, well, God told me. See, those things, when handled correctly, need to go through the filter of the, whole, of the Word of God. So if someone came up to you and said, you know what? God told me I was supposed to do X, Y, Z, and those things weren't biblical. They were seeking revenge. They were from a bitter heart on the other person. Then the, God didn't tell them that. So we need in our own life, before we ever say, I feel like God told me something, we need to take that something through the filter of the word of God, because God will never contradict himself. God talks primarily to us through the word. That means we read the word of God and those things that stand out that I call them spiritually highlighted. That is God talking to you. Also, he will talk to us in three, two, three ways, through prayer, through people, and through events. So no matter if it's through people, through events, or through prayer, that has to go through the filter of the Word of God, because if it contradicts the Word of God, it is not from God. Alrighty? But this is beautiful, because Jesus says, I have more to tell you but I'm not going to have time to say it because I am about to leave this earth. But the Holy Spirit that I am going to leave you, he is going to speak for me and he is going to tell you the things that you need to know. So my friend today, the question is, what is, what was the latest thing or what is something that the Holy Spirit told you that was important? My friends, can't wait to hear the answers to this. I love you and God's got this.